What up? All right. Um, so uh, we got another one from In Living Color. Hmm. Okay. Okay. In Living Color. Yes. What we got? This is Men on Films. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Well, let's go. And now, Public Access presents Men on Films. Hello, I'm Blaine Edwards, and I'm Antoine Merriweather, and welcome to Men on Films. We're going to be reviewing the latest films from a male point of view. First up is that controversial movie, Do the Right Thing. Now, I really like little Spike Lee's courage in making this film. I especially like the way he mixed the racial tension with the violence in order to give his message, <laughs> do the right thing. Come on out the closet. Don't be afraid to be who you is. Black, white, or whatever. Mm-hmm. Ain't that the truth, Ruth? <laughs> now I'd like to talk about an exciting new film, Karate Kid Part 3. It's all about men working out their problems in a very physical way. It was all so primitive. Mm-hmm. And you know, I really enjoyed Mr. Miyagi, played by little Pat Morita. Ooh, and that Ralph Mar- you. Three words. Fab, you love. <laughs> Boy, I hope I look that good when I'm 40. Stop. But I have to disagree. I disagree. There's just too much violence in this movie. <laughs> Don't get mad. <laughs> Give me back my scarf. <laughs> Don't hate me because I'm beautiful. <laughs> they went all wrong. What's all this kicking about? This is a movie about relationships. This could have been a beautiful picture about the special friendship between a mature, masculine, older man and a tender, ripening, consenting young man. See, I think America's ready for that. You know, I know I am. <laughs> Bet you is. <laughs> now I'd like to talk about a film I've been anxiously waiting to see, Great Balls of Fire. I ain't gonna touch it. <laughs> but the title alone gets two snaps up. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> talk about some films that are soon to come out on video. First up is Black Widow, starring Teresa Russell and Deborah Winger. Hated it. <laughs> also coming out is Miss Firecracker. Is that Gene Anthony Ray's new movie? <laughs> Holly Hunter. Hated it. <laughs> and we finally have Dangerous Liaison. Starring John Malkovich and Glenn Close. Mm. You know, John Malkovich is like every moviegoer's fantasy. I found myself just alone at night just thinking about his intensity. Yeah. <laughs> what you think of Glenn Close? Oh, I loved him. <laughs> and I really have to admire the producers for Dan to cast a man in that role. I mean, that really made the picture for me. Hello? Glenn Close is a woman. Clutch the pearls. What a sneaky thing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Well, looks like we're almost out of time. Would you join us next week when we talk about Mel Gibson's lethal weapon? I hope it's loaded. <laughs> you crazy. stayed in character <laughs> that shit <laughs> looked like it was impossible that was, that was where <laughs> this nigga David oh, Wayne had a man. scarf <laughs> and a fucking blouse <laughs> oh, he said great balls of fire <laughs> I won't touch <laughs> not touching me these oh, niggas oh man Jesus <laughs> yeah, men on films yeah, my favorite Damien Wayne's movie, The Low Down Dirty Shame. Oh, yeah. Yeah, man. Damien Dirty Shame. Jada Pinkin in it? 
Yeah. Yeah, man. Great movie, man. Mm-hmm.